This can change your business and your life. This can be the reason you get to quit your nine to five. This can be it. The reason you are able to fully step into freedom and the cozy pajama lifestyle. And you know, you already know what this is because you've read the title of this video, you've seen the thumbnail, your email list. You need one for your blog, for your business, wherever you create content on the internet. You need to have an email list. I'm gonna shout this from the rooftops forever and until forever, even in 2023. Yes, you do. You need an email list. Email marketing is still sizzling hot. Let me just say. And in this video, we're gonna dive into the reasons why you need to have an email list. If you are brand new to this beautiful concept called email marketing, I do have a free guide, a the dream list roadmap, as I've called it, which you can find in the description below. It's free. And in that free guide, I go through the step by step of starting your very own email list and what you should focus on everything. So get your hands on that one and then come right back to this video. Why email marketing? What is the big woof? All right, so let's just hit the pretend button right now and pretend that Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Pinterest, Google, oh my God, all of these platforms, they vanish overnight. And guess what else is going to vanish. Your income, your audience, everything could potentially be gone if Mark Zuckerberg decides to pull the plug on Facebook and Instagram and threats. This is quite the nightmare situation. How are you going to reach your audience? How are you going to promote your offers? How are you going to be able to keep living that sweet, cozy pajama lifestyle? You won't. That will all go away if you build your business on borrowed land, which you do if you don't have an email list. Because social media is just rented space space on the internet. You don't own your followers on social media. Mark Z does. So this is the first reason why having an email list is so, so important. It really is your security blanket. Because when you build an email list of subscribers, of lovely human beings, you own that list of emails and names. You can carry them with you in your pocket if you want to on a piece of paper. You always have a way to contact your audience. This is the biggest reason why email marketing is still very much needed in the online business space and to be honest, I don't think it'll ever go away. So you need it. It's your security blanket. Another reason why you need to build an email list is because it gives your content and your message more reach and more engagement. Because here's the thing. Did you know that around six to 10%, according to some statistics website that I found on the internet, of your followers on social media will actually see the content that you put out there? Six to 10%. I mean, what? That is shocking. That's that algorithm for you. Doing it's magic. With an email list, you will always be able to communicate with your audience, to share your latest content, to, to drive traffic to your blog and your content. Because no matter what, you're going to end up in that inbox and they are going to be forced to take action. They're going to either open it, hopefully, and read it, archive it, delete it, or mark it as spam. So make sure you're writing non-spammy emails, okay? We definitely don't want our emails to end up in the folder where emails go to die, the spam folder. Another reason why you need to have an email list is you are able to segment your list, meaning you're able to, to really organize your list of subscribers. By segmenting, I mean that you can tag your subscribers depending on various factors, where they're from, what they're interested in, if they bought your offer, if they didn't buy it, depending on where they are on their journey as it relates to your niche. Like there's so many different ways that you can organize your subscribers. That way you can write emails that they really need when it comes to where they are in their journey. This way you are more likely to resonate, to build trust and to turn those subscribers into customers because you have tailored those emails to exactly what they need and want to hear the most. When you have an email list of subscribers, you're forming a bestie like connection. This is honestly why I am so passionate about email marketing, about copywriting. It's because of this connection that's built with your audience through emails. I don't know what it is, but when you end up in someone's inbox, it just feels a little bit more personal, actually a lot more personal than social media. It's like you have a direct line to be able to communicate with your audience, a direct line open to your most engaged audience. You know, you're sending that email from your heart to theirs 
via their inbox. That's how I look at it. Plus another cool thing that you can do with email marketing that you can't with social media is personalize the emails that you send out. So in the subject line and in the content of the email, you can actually call out your subscribers by name. I mean, how nice, <laughs> how freaking lovely. Because building trust and building a relationship with your audience is a must do. You know, if you wanna make money, if you want a successful business, and if you wanna make sales, because that's the next reason. More sales, more money. There, I said it. We all wanna make money, like let's not shy away from the fact that we're in business to make a profit alongside helping people. And here's another fun fact for you. For every dollar that you spend on your email marketing journey, the return on that investment is about $42. What? That's a little bit crazy and insane. And I'd say yes, please to that. And hello, freedom. I'd happily spend $1 if it's gonna make me $42 back. That is the power of email marketing. It is hands down the best way to sell and promote to your audience. It's my favorite way to sell. It's my favorite way to be sold to. Like I buy from emails. I don't really buy off of people's websites or on social media. Sometimes I do, but mostly I buy from emails that are sent to me. So the best way to sell and promote your offers is through email marketing and setting up sales funnels, passive sales funnels that are automated. That way you get to really step into the cozy pajama lifestyle and you get to hit play on Netflix and watch, not Friends, because that's not on Netflix anymore, but whatever show that you watch and you get to make money while you're doing other things. That is the beauty and the magic of email marketing. So really, it all comes down to this. The dream is in the list. Every single marketer is gonna tell you that the money is in the list. I've just tweaked this a little bit and I've gone ahead and said that the dream is in the list. And this is exactly why I've named my upcoming email marketing course, The Dream is in the list because it really is. The dream that you have right now of the cozy pajama lifestyle, of quitting your job, of becoming your own boss, of helping thousands of people and getting your message out there. It really, it exists in the list. So I hope that you're feeling excited about email marketing and the possibilities of it, and that you now have a solid understanding of why it's still so important to have an email list in 2023. So the next steps for you now is to grab that free guide that I've created for you. It'll take you through the step-by-step -step process of getting started with your list building efforts. It'll teach you everything that you need to know in order to build your list of dreamy subscribers, of human beings with beating hearts. Because remember, behind each of those emails and names that you collect, there's a human being. So keep that in mind and grab that free guide because honey, you need an email list. So I'll leave it at that. And also toodles and cozy vibes. Peace out.